Welcome back, everybody, for some more Chola Dynasty. Last time we made a bunch of Therasadi and blew stuff up, but now we're going to be going to the Tamil Raja. It is hard to imagine that it took only two decades for a Tamil king to restore the former glory of the dynasty from suffering being defeated, and use the sword in his hand to seize back the lost lands even harvest several times the territory. But it's far from over. Rajaraja Raja spent his last two years of life to pass down the dynasty to his successor, Rajendra I. Although he was almost 50 years old when he took over the throne, Rajendra still lived up to expectations by creating an unprecedented splendor of the empire. As early as when Rajaraja Raja was in the southern and northern wars, Rajendra had followed his father to rule the country witnessing the arrival of the golden era of the dynasty step by step. However, for Rajendra as his successor, the glorious chapter of the empire has just begun, and more wars and conquests await this rising star. What, so it's like Rajendra 3, which is literally rising star? Oh god, oh god, oh god. Ah. Uh, nope. Uh, hold on, hold on. Need to adjust the volume. There we go. I will settle for the status quo. Oh my god, we have 97 pop? Okay. Let's just try and get everyone to work. Oh my god. The only Tamil king deserves to rule the South India. Um, I don't know, go over that way. Oh my god. Monastery. What? Oh my god. Um, maybe fall back to this tower? Let's get Bodkin. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. What's over here? Oh, more stuff. Okay, kind of getting that down. Oh god. Um, repair you. I don't care about no tiger. We will keep fighting and defend the lands of Benji until our last breath here. Okay, let's just lure you. Okay, that's all fine. Okay. <sighs> this looks exactly like Rising Star, except now we need 800 influence points instead of 10. But, okay, defeat Pandya. Chera will surrender if Panya is defeated. Destroy the three castles of Chera. Defeat Chera to subjugate it. Destroy the Bengali's docks. Kill King Mahinda. Protect the Wonder. Protect all your castles. Protect Eastern Chalukya. Collect all five relics. Wait, kill capture King Mahinda. Oh. Um... Okay, we cannot construct castles, and we can't get influence for the wonders completed, or we can't lose it. Pull up your defenses quickly. Yeah, I got that. Uh, all the different ways of getting influence. We have our empire, the Western Chalukyas. 
uh, the Bengali pirates, there's Pandya, and the Sinhalese. So it's like Rajendra 2 and 3 mixed together. Now, um, don't think we're going to be getting King Mahinda in 10 minutes. I assume he's down over here in Sri Lanka, yeah. Don't really want to like just restart everything and try and speed run this. There is enough going on here. Okay, you are all built back up. We need lumberjacks, man. Also, this seems heavily based off of the first scenario. Oh, uh, we can click up to Imp. We only have one barracks. How'd you guys get in? Oh my god! Uh, get the relic! Oh no. Okay, there's the Vengi guys. Get that. <sighs> okay, gill nuts. Yeah, we're just going to get our eco going. There's just so much going on. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. All right. Yes, here are our castles. Oh, no, no. Oh, that's where I was getting so many of my gold miners from. So, I assume I can't build bombard towers, but I'm not going to want to spam keeps everywhere until I get my, uh... I want to get, like, confirmation. Alright. Click up to imp. Get you. Oh, God. Oh, God. What are you doing, jerk? Cut 
Okay. Kind of stabilizing ish. Ish. This is so stressful, guys. In case you couldn't tell. Cut the win. Oh my god. Oh, uh, let's see if we get Bombard Tower. You make me sad. That's okay, spamming stuff. Spamming keeps everywhere can be fun too, I suppose. You repair that. Okay, we just... No! It's so many elephants! Oh my goodness. Okay, um, get some more Ellie Archer Academies, also known as Archery Ranger, Archery Rangers. How's this area? I still have a relic. Is there like a relic in here? It seems like an area that would have a relic. Guess not. Oh! Called it! I guess this is Anadaranapura or whatever it's called. Okay, um, we're gonna need to get some fast fire ships out. I know Theresad I are awesome, but they're actually kind of weak to fire ships. Anyway, let's get some towers down. Get keep in. I mean, Dravidians have keeps with arrow slits and heated shots, so it's not like our towers are bad even without bombard towers. Dravidians are just a pretty, pretty solid defensive sieve, especially now that they have bombards. The only thing they're kind of missing in that regard is, like, monks. Or good monks. They have monks, obviously. <laughs> Otherwise, how would I be getting relics? <sighs> Why aren't all of you guys building the frickin' wonder? Oh, there's more stone over here. That'll be helpful. Look at the magnificent achievement of my father. We must protect the symbol of the glory of the empire at all costs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ungrishitum. 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 
கணமே போகிறேன் என்ன கட்டவேன் என்ன கட்டளை கட்டுவேன் Ellie Archer's going. Let's get some trebs popping. There's gold over here I can take in Sri Lanka if need be. Okay. That should help us reclaim the coastline a little bit. Let's get some Therasadi out. Steel. Oh, there's still stone divine over here. Oh yeah, Elite Arumi would certainly be a nice one to pick up. Let's try and fight underneath our uh, our keep. Okay, out of gold over there. There's more I can take this away. Oh my god. Get you. That. Get some elephant archers. Get you guys over here. They aren't elite roomies. That's something. Whoa! Oh my god. Rathas, stop transporting! Some keeps on my coast. Some coast keeps. Oh, what's why is there an Arumi over here? Seriously? I guess we can get some of you. Guys. 
No, 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 no. At least they're only armored elephants, they're not siege elephants. Whoa, 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 whoa. gold I can take over there. Build a freaking farm, I don't care how bad it is. Are you, like, repairing it or something? Because that would be a jerk move. Alright, keep on keeping on. How'd you guys get over here? Oh, that's probably where the Arumis and stuff. I thought this went like all the way over here, but I really haven't had a chance to breathe in this scenario, have I? Uh, I can't make some skirms if need be. Dravidian skirms are really good. I, I know I haven't made them much in this campaign just because skirms aren't really the best campaign unit. Uh, but they're really good to use in multiplayer. Oh, relic. R -r 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 relic. Honestly, not a bad trade route here. All right, we're hitting 200 population this year. These guys have been like idle all game long. Just go patrol into something. That castle's still standing just fine. Why does it look like I see all of this stuff in the fog of war? Really weird. Okay, you go back over that way. Let's get uh, some more farms. Go that away. I know these markets are close to the shoreline, but at the same time, they are protected by those keeps. And I, I haven't seen them make cannon galleons yet. Like, if I can't make cannon galleons because there isn't gunpowder in 11th century South India, then I assume that is going to be the case for them as well. Let's check this before trade carts. Relic captured. Good, good, good. Hey, 
Okay, I mean, these... Well, these stone walls are useless, by the way. Isn't it like if I defeat Pandya, then Chera surrenders? At least the Eastern Chalukyas are seemingly quite helpful. Yeah, it's like I see all this stuff in the Fog of War. I wonder if that's a bug. Oh, you know what? I bet that this doesn't... There's like a bug that it doesn't undo the black area on the minimap. That used to be a bug in DE, I remember. Sorry. Why is there a stone wall right here? Alrighty. Onward and upward. You guys just destroy that gate. Yeah, like, this is all still black area for some reason. Okay, you guys go forward. Okay, let's go. Please don't destroy my trebuchet. Hey, what? Wait, seriously? My father's wish also be fulfilled. Now we can achieve moksha from samsara. Um. Okay. I like I was so <laughs> I was so stressed all game long. I didn't even realize that I was like about to win. Felt like I didn't even do anything. <laughs> the South Indian Tamil forces headed by the Pandya dynasty have gradually shown signs of retreating under the fierce offensive of the Chola army. Those who never or refused to bow down to Rajendra in the battlefield, what they would be greeted were the wrath and the trampling of the elephants. Meanwhile, the alliance, formed by Chola and the eastern Trilukyas, had strengthened the border defense of the dynasty. The western Trilukyas could only pose only a token threat, no longer shattering the confidence of Rajendra. Although the western Trilukyas were defeated in repeated battles, Rajendra did not relax and indulge for a moment because of the re-emergence of the empire. The dynasty went through hundreds of years of continuous wars, but still did not end one day. Rajendra Chola decided to force these neighboring countries completely bow to Chola. Like his father, as the empire grew, the ambitions of the monarch was constantly revealed to the world. Alrighty. Well, Pretty darn good KD. Oh my god, that was that was stressful, man. <laughs> like I don't even know what all of the different uh, options were. I remember the scenario is to kill King Mahinda in under ten minutes, which I guess you could like speed run with these siege elephants. Uh, these guys don't seem all that strong. The Bengali pirates are over here in the east. Raiding me with their rathas. 
There's a relic here we could take. Oh, there's like a transport E relic over there. But the Western Chalukyas are naturally over here with the big old camp. Wait, that's a Gaia lumber camp and mill? Kind of random. Pretty similar to the first scenario. But this time with Regendra. But also kind of similar to Rising Star and, uh, you know, what we're supposed to do. Alrighty, guys. So that was the Tamil Raja. And next up will be Sincere Believer. See you guys next time for that one.